Hi people, welcome to another episode of Mr B's Buildings. We are at Cobden Mill in Farnworth. We're having a look outside as far as we can get to the building. Um, it was built in the 1820s as far as I've read. If I've read it wrong, I am very sorry if I got the date wrong. But let's have a look outside. But I've got a little special feature in the video um, that I've give, given permission to do. So, let's have a look. Uh, this is a mill, Cobden Mill in Farmer. There used to be a spinning mill in the day. So imagine all them looms coming round. I can't get any closer for you people because behind here is a pond. And that would have belonged to the mill at the time. But now it's a, fish a fishing lodge, which we will see in our video very shortly, people. Now I'm going to film and go around the other side, so bear with me, I'll pause it. Hello and welcome back um, from the street view here, the other street view, this is the mill. I said it might be interesting to you people, but I like to do a bit of history in case it got knocked down. But here is the fisherman's pond here. But imagine in the day that would have belonged to the mill. But yeah, um, we're going to go here. And we're going to have a look at the mill itself. Now, from right to left, let's have a look. Small look for you people. Zoom it in here. Wow. Now, I'm going to see if I can get in the, these gates and have a look round. Have a look at these buildings. Pawson. Pawson. Um, yeah, that's a mill. Might have shown it you a bit more. Right, I'm going to pause it a minute because there's a bloke up there. Wait till he goes in and wait till this guy goes outside, then I'll go in and have a look. I'm just going to go in. But yeah, as you can see, we're going to get a bit up and personal to this building. So these, maybe in the day, would have been uh, for trucks or something, because they've got an old canopy there. And the stops there to stop the trucks from going on. But yeah, that's how high it is. And again, up there you've got the uh, where they used to lower stuff. And I wonder what these were in the day. what these used to be in the day but look at these windows big damn windows are you can't go up here that's a fire view but yeah look at that stairway there for your fire view going from the top window all the way down all the way down now let's see what we can see around this side. Yeah, that's the other side of the building here. And look at this bit here. Another bit of girder sticking out the side of that window. Top of that uh, on this side. That's got a little uh, light pulley on it. Ah. Wow, open personal, it's owned by the lighting inter interior group at the moment. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to the other side of the building. So bear with me while I go around. And then we'll uh, do this little bit of a special thing for you people. So bear with me as we're passing. That's the... Uh, that's a fishing lodge at the moment, but it would have been part of the uh, 
Ah, so the uh, the mill in its day, this. Don't know if it'd be to power the uh, steam engines or what. I don't know, to be honest. So that's a mill. That's a little bit of water, so bear with me. Just walking past some railings here. But I, what I would think is these have been here since the mill was built, maybe. So I wonder what years these... This little bit of fence in here. What years it was. <laughs> right, people, we're near the front. So just through that gate there, you go into the building. And this is uh, near the front. And up there, like the other side, it's got a... Uh, big girder there that's got a little pulley on it that in the day and look at the door that door would have opened in the day and they would either lift the goods up from the roadway there just about here where this car is go up there and pull it through there and again the other side they got one this side as well there you go and again another door so, where the old jalopy is there, just further up there, again, it would have been up there. And you can see the bit what, that's been bricked up where my finger is here, and here, and just here, there would have been something there in the day, maybe another window. And these blocks off here would have been windows, because it's a cotton mill. And look at this beauty there arch window there and I don't know what these doors would have been in the day if you went in there or not but there's the old other fire door and let's look at this building here now I don't know what this building was in the in the day but yeah but look at these So whatever this building was in the day when the cotton mill was here. I don't know. Right, we're going to go to the... Uh, look at this. Cobble way here. All the streets would have been like this in the day. Right, special thing for you in a minute. So bear with us. So here we are. Going through the gate here. Yeah? Looking at the outside near the entrance here. How oh, these would have been windows in the day. And down here. I don't know what they be. Just the pipes from the building. Oh, what would that have been? But yeah, look at this. Interesting bit of thing. Was that a door? Some sort of door. I don't know. Have a quick look down here. Can't see much because it's got a bit of litter in it and stuff. But yeah. Now. And there's the other side. The building outside. But yeah. I wonder if they went in here in the day. Because we'll have a look. Let's go through. They wouldn't have had these doors here. What have had these doors here in the day? Or oh, the shutter. So, let's go through and have a look for you people. There's the stairs. So, imagine going up these stairs in the day. And this is an old lift. How long has this been in here? Obviously, it's broke at the moment, but look at the old call button. Push that in. <laughs> we'll see some doors. But look at this architecture here. Wow. And up there. But yeah, imagine going up these stairs, people. Obviously, it wouldn't have looked like that. It wouldn't have had these lights or these lights or that lighting sign there. But the rail would have been original. This is how the wall might have been in the day. But yeah, we're going to the first floor here, people. Again, them lights here wouldn't be here. But 
yeah, let's look out of these windows. This is inside. And these are the windows. Now this is a lift that's broken, but look at them. How old is that lift? And there uh, again, press the button. Nothing is it? But look at these windows. That's a view that you would have got from these windows. The view. Wow. Let's go up these stairs. Get them on the floor. Fabulous people. Like I said, we're being quiet because we're actually inside a all the old original pipes there and gas pipe. Can't go up here because obviously the things there. But uh, let's have a quick look through here. Yeah. Yeah. We're going to get out of here and wrap this video up. I'd like to, um, I'd like to uh, say a very thank you to uh, a guy. Yeah, imagine coming out to this building here and going through here in the day. Or maybe up there, I don't know. But going home from doing a shift at this cotton mill, when it was a cotton mill in the day. But look at this that we noticed on the roadway. Some sort of gate post here. So when it stays, it maybe had, had a, gate pole, a gate on it. But anyway, I'm gonna turn around, look at this building, and say a big uh, thank you to uh, to Oliver at uh, the Lighting Interior Group. Big thumbs up to you, sir. Thank you very much for giving us permission to go up them steps. Um, so I'd just like to say, if you like the channel, please put a big thumbs up, and if you want to subscribe, subscribe. Uh, you're quite welcome to. You don't have to if you don't want to or leave your comments. Um, and if you want to press the uh, next bell one for my next video, please do. So anyway, thanks for watching. Hope that you liked the little video of outside of this uh, Cobden Mill in Farnworth. I, knew, I know I couldn't go inside and have a look at the main, uh, see if there was any interesting structures and stuff. Um, I mean, they will be in there. All the, uh, all like the post and stuff, but unfortunately I couldn't go in. So anyway, thanks for watching. Hope that you like this little bit of video, and um, see you on the next one. Thanks very much. It's a big goodbye from Mr. Beast Buildings. Thanks for watching. Bye bye.